Hello everybody, welcome back to Drunken Sailor, and I am Bill, your Drunken Sailor. Today is a day that we're going to talk a little bit about classic cocktails, and I know this one's a classic. My dad drank this one for years, so it's, it's got to be classic, if, if nothing else, it was old. Um, but we're going to do it with a little bit of a twist. We are going to do this one two different ways. Today's cocktails are the Manhattan and the perfect Manhattan. So let's get pouring. Our first cocktail is the classic Manhattan, and it's really pretty simple. As you can see, there's only three ingredients to it. So we are going to start with two ounces of rye whiskey. And that's going to go into our mixing glass. Next, we are going to use three quarters of an ounce of sweet vermouth. And that's going in our mixing glass. Next ingredient, three dashes of Angostura bitters. That's it. That's everything that's in the mixing glass. We're going to ice this up and we're going to stir. We're using some big chunks in there. And the more ice that you actually put in there, the colder it's going to get. And you're going to give this a stir. And you'll see the bottom of the glass start to uh, condense and then you're chill. And now, all we have left to do is pour. So, once again, we're going to use a chilled glass. This time we're using a Nick and Nora glass. We're going to strain the ice. Garnish on this is one cherry. And there we have the classic Manhattan. Next up, there's one little bit of a twist to it, and we call this one the Perfect Manhattan. Very, very similar, so let's get started on that one. Once again, mixing glass. We're going to use rye whiskey again. Two ounces of rye. We're going to use our Sweet vermouth. This time we're going to use a half an ounce. Next, and this is the big difference between the two of them, is we're also going to put in a half an ounce of dry vermouth. And once again, final ingredient in there, three dashes of bitters. And that's an Angostura bitter that we're using. Next, we're going to ice up the mixing glass. And we're going to give it another stir and chill this down. And grab our glass and strain that. As you can see, it's just a little bit lighter in color. And there we have, with the addition of our cherry, the perfect Manhattan. And there you go, folks, a tale of two cities, a Manhattan two different ways. Cheers.